Hey family, Zach here. Happy Sunday. It's the day after the spring equinox 2021 and I've had a good day. Purpose of this video, talking a little bit about emotional release. I, <laughs> the past couple of days, I have found these little bubbling up of emotions going on within me, subtle. And I look at them and I've observed them. And at first I was like, what is this? Like, I didn't know what it was, what was causing it? Where did it stem from? But I just gave it love and it's transmuted. It's beautiful. And the same thing happened just now. I was lying down and uh, yeah, I, I just felt sad, but I realized what I was feeling sad about this time. And it was the fact that last year in 2020, I got, I got engaged twice to the same person. And it, it was, it was kind of traumatic and heartbreaking that it didn't work out like it was it's just sad because we both did our best we both wanted it to work we both genuinely wanted it to work and it was just so sad how it didn't in such a seemingly short space of time as well. So, I'm making this just to be vulnerable and just to say, hey, if you're feeling a little bit sensitive right now, if you're feeling like there's some trauma coming up or just some sadness, or you're just feeling some kind of heavier emotion, especially sadness, maybe a bit of fear, even anger as well, let yourself feel it. Let yourself go through it. And then bring in the love. I need to keep sharing this more consistently so more and more people not only hear the message for the first time, but also actually act on it. <laughs> it's not going to work if you don't actually act on it. But when you do act on it, it's one of those ones I've found personally very transformative, very powerful. So, <clears throat> yeah, I was just feeling a little bit sad. I was laying down and just letting myself go there, letting myself feel it. And this time it was like an apology combined with an I love you affirmation. So I started just kind of hands on heart, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for what we've been through. I'm sorry to my body. I'm sorry to my emotions. For what we've been through. For this painful situation that we've experienced. And it felt really good. It was very healing. And then I just felt this warmth just from doing the apologies and then proceeded and said, I love you. I love you. And it melted, melted more. It was, it was interesting as an emotion. It was every emotion is going to be felt differently, right? Sometimes they're so intense that they physically hurt like hell and then other times like this one today for me it was it was it wasn't even that it was uncomfortable in fact I actually find out of the three emotions sadness is like probably my favorite because it's it can lead to such easy transformation So I did that, I brought in the love and 
it melted really quickly. If I was recording this video two years in the past from now, it wouldn't have been so fast. There would have been a lot more for me to have worked through first. <laughs> and I know that this is true, not only for myself, but so many other people, which is amazing. Let me know, comment, send me a message, something, just say, tell me how much quicker your emotions are moving through you now compared to just maybe even a year, two years, three years ago. Upgrades, now is the time. It is upgrade time, it's upgrade season, Equinox 2021. Cells, changing, DNA, light upgrades, light body activation coming more fully online than ever before. One more layer. One more layer added or one more layer peeled away? It's one more layer peeled away. Hmm. Awesome. So I just wanted to share this. The more love you bring in, quicker the emotions bubble down and are healed. Don't forget there's always layers. It's never just a, it's never just a case of, oh, I can let it all out now and bring love to it and I'll be healed forevermore. That wouldn't really be possible because if we did feel all of our emotions at once, built up from all of our childhood, from all of our past lives, all at once. We would go into a state of psychosis. And it would take, yeah, it would take a lot of love to pull us out of something like that. So yeah, that's why it's not really gonna be experienced that way. Some people on the planet are gonna experience that within the next two to three decades, I would say, with certainty, with certainty. Hmm. So, thank you for sharing this space with me today, this evening. Thank you for doing your inner work. Thank you for lifting yourself up. You're doing real good. I love you. Thank you for you. Arrivederci. Bello. <laughs>